welcome back guys so this is section 4.8 and here we have uh, in this section three questions 37 38 and 39 okay so in this series what we will do we will solve each of the question in our upcoming videos and in this video as well so here let me talk about the question 37 which is related to the Karnoff maps so what are basically the Karnoff maps Karnoff maps are basically the maps for simplifying the boolean expressions okay and we will see that how these are used to simplify the boolean expressions so now here the question 37 is draw a three variable Karnoff map and label each cell according to its binary value okay so what we have to do we have to draw a Karnoff map of the three variables so let me call those three variables as a b and C okay so in the Karnoff map what we will have to do we will have to draw a table okay just like it this will be a table here okay and here in this table we have to draw here and here we have to write one variable and let me write it with this color and let me write it C so here this C can have two values okay what can be those values those values can be zero and one okay similarly let me write here a b so as these are the two variables here so what are these these can have also four values so those are those values are zero 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 one okay so after it what we will have to do in the corner of map i cannot write here one zero because uh, zero one and one zero we will uh, we will see that the difference between them will be of two bits but the adjacent entry should have a difference of one so therefore i will have to write one one and after it i can write one zero so you can see that there is a difference of only one bit in between them so let me draw this table like it okay so this is here this is like this this and this okay so this is a table for the three variable Karnoff map so what uh, else we will have to do let me now combine them so now combining them what I will get let me use this blue color so these two zero zeros will be here and this zero will be here so this is zero 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 and similarly this zero zero will also be here in this second uh, first row second column and this one will be here so zero 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 one okay similarly this will be here so zero one and this one for which the column we have this will be zero and here i will have the same values in which row i am here so that is 0 1 and the same value of the column so that is 1 here as well so 0 1 1 okay similarly now the row has been changed so here it will be 1 1 and the column is 0 here okay and uh, this row again and the column here as well and similarly the row here is 1 0 and the column is 0 and the row is 1 0 and the column is 1 okay so these are the entries for the corner of map uh, which I was going to draw here so that is the Karnoff map uh, for the three variable and all these values are the binary values for all the variables okay so I think it's enough for today and in our upcoming video we will try to talk about the problem 38 and 39 till then take care of yourself and I will see you soon